oh god uh i was so keen uh i wrote maybe four at least four maybe more um lyrics for what ultimately became burn burn was one of the the lyrics the sci-fi poem i've never done that before uh, and that's the one Richie, of course, adored, you know, uh, and the, the one that's on, on the actual song now. I had a version which John Lord and I uh, would laugh about for many years uh, when we were warming up for shows. Um, Burn, I had a lyric called The Road. You know, take me down the road, you know, which was highly amusing. But, uh, but the lyrics were good, very blues-based lyrics, and that was cool. Um, I remember uh, writing uh, up all night, writing the lyrics to the song Sail Away. Um, and, you know, I, uh, in those days, I, would, I had this feeling that everything had to be done after midnight, you know, when there was minimal distraction or whatever. Um, and I'd been up literally all night uh, writing the Sail Away, which I thought was one of the best lyrics I'd written. And... Uh, and I'd literally just got into bed and my phone started ringing in the hotel. I'm going, uh, and I pick up the phone and go, what is it? What is it? I've just gone to bed. Leave me a uh, photo, photo shoot or something like this. And I went, yeah, no, 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 no. And put the phone off and the phone kept ringing until I threw it against the wall and, you know, smashed it or whatever. Then there's banging at my door as I'm drifting off to sleep. Uh, and, uh, and yeah, it was, I was furious. And, I, you know, I, we looked at some of the pictures when we were doing the, uh, the video shoot of Sail Away. Uh, they're in DDZ, D D Zill's book uh, on the history of Deep Purple, photographic history. Uh, and we're, you know, taking up some mountain at ridiculous time in the morning to catch morning mist and stuff. And we all look like poop. You know, but particularly me, not my favorite session. And this is the first time Richie and I had uh, unpleasant words with each other because I'm a Yorkshireman. It's, you know, I'm not going to take any poop. We don't, we're not known for that. Um, so I see on the pictures that we were keeping our distance from each other. But uh, it was when I was recording um, uh, the, the song. Uh, and if, if you remember, the original song is a big, big swaggering uh, guitar synth riff uh, and Pacey's. I mean, it's, it's amazing uh, track. I'm actually recording it live, and as I'm singing, I'm going, "Oh my god, oh my god, it's too low." Because I'd written it and sung to a cassette uh, player, you know, which was very easy for me to hear what I was doing on top of of this song. But with all this in the headphones, I'm going, "Oh my god, it's too low. I've completely blown it." And I stopped singing. I said, "Oh my god, I'm so sorry." Uh, it's too low. I'm going to have to rethink this, you know, and every second thinking, wow, this could be the, my, you know, ticket home, you know. Uh, and John Lord, God bless him, came running in, spilling his drink, going, Davy lad, don't change a thing. It's amazing. It's the best thing I've ever heard. God bless him. And ultimately, you know, uh, I recorded uh, it that way. But when I did the re-recording uh, on the, the Purple album, it was very, very... Uh, natural for me to to, uh, to 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 feel it in an un unplugged, different different musical structure, uh, which I think uh, is a suitable, uh, as, you know, equally suitable uh, approach to take uh, for that for the kind of song it is.